Hello everyone and welcome back to Game of Thrones and you now last video is uh, has required short so you know because I want to make sure Moore's part and Alistair part so now continue play this game and let's talk with with uh them with him. Ah uh, Howard Houghton Alistair. I was anxious to speak with you. Did you meet any trouble on your way here? Ah, well, other than the warm welcome I received from an amateur theologian in your employ, I have no complaints. You must be speaking of Sir Ethan. He's the captain of my watch. Please forgive him. He is bound to the Seven. While I was waiting for you, I made the mistake of telling him that you belong to the clergy of Rilor. But enough small talk. <laughs> we yeah. have some important matters to deal with. For a stranger, he seemed elderly familiar. Why speak to me here? Where are we? What do you have to say that's so important and so secretive? We're safe here in my room, away from the spider's web. I feel like you know me, but I don't believe I've had the pleasure. That's understandable. The last time we spoke was so very long ago. Before the rebellion, I visited your father many a time. You were young back then, and more interested in the art of combat than conversation. More recently, I attended your father's funeral. But it was not the time for discussions. I wish to tell you that your sudden and unexpected bereavement troubled me deeply. Reynald was a great man and a trusted friend. With him gone, I'm now worried about your sister. I discovered that you were set on marrying your bastard brother, Vilar. This man carries a grim reputation since the war, and it has only gotten worse since he became a servant of the Queen. Vilar is quite keen on marrying my sister indeed, but it won't happen if I manage to get back my titles. But that is a matter for another time. You spoke of some news of Garwin. Tell me what has become of him. Yeah. Yes, your brother. Knowing that you were in King's Landing, I thought I'd find you and share my fears with you. What fears? If you're talking about Garwin being accused of patricide, I already know about it. Yes, but I came to King's Landing to ask him if there was any truth to this tale. Unfortunately, I have been unable to do so, and now I fear that he is fleeing from some trouble. Or worse yet, that trouble has already caught up to him. My initial findings were quite worrisome, to say the least. So did I hear that Rai Garwin might be died? Oh damn. What do you mean? What did you discover? Ah, well, I managed to track down Garwin to King's Landing, hoping I'd be able to confront him before he vanished again. According to my sources, a friend of his had helped him find refuge in a cellar, only accessible through the sewers. Unfortunately, something terrible occurred before I could get there. Rumors of murders started circulating. I fear that your brother has met a tragic end. By the flame, I need to know what became of him. I understand. As a friend of your father's, I wish to offer you my help. Let me introduce you to Sir Desmond. He is my sworn sword and the very best swordsman in the Riverlands. He has helped me gather up what little information we have. As a former gold cloak, he still keeps a few friends in the city watch and has tried to question them about these murders. According to them, there was no investigation and it seems that very few people in the city watch have any inkling of what happened. Those who appeared to know something had clearly been ordered to keep their mouth shut and certainly seemed as if someone was trying to keep this quiet. It looks like I need to go to the crime scene myself. My friends in the city watch showed me how to get to the cellar that your brother was supposedly hiding in. Given its location, we should be able to take a look around quietly. We'll just have to deal with the bolt that the gold cloaks put there to prevent access. Then we should leave immediately. There's no time to lose. Lord Halton, will you let Sir Desmond accompany me? I believe I could do with another sword at my side. Of course. The sewers are one of the most dangerous places in King's Landing, and I would feel better knowing that he's with you. Thank you. 
If yeah. you're interested, my lord, I know an entrance to the sewers not far from here. Perfect. Let's go. Hey. So now I need to go down there. So yeah, go this way. Hey, hey, hey. No. Okay. So now is chapter of page. No, can I upgrade? No. Inventory. Nope. Oh, uh, it's alright. Now can I go this way? No. Let's make sure um, the way I walk is right. Which way? Okay, right away. And go this way, then the uh, okay, right, right or through, through it. No, wait, wait, wait. Map. Okay, right. Yeah, this way. Heh. <laughs> Sword of King's Landing. Yeah, I've been here once, I think. Here we are. Normally we would go straight on, but the gate is shut. We will have to make a detour through the arena. The arena? You'll see. We're going to take the left path. And stay on your guard. These sewers are crawling with thieves. City laws have no reach down here. Wait. So, where should I go now? This way? No. Okay, damn. How long have you been with the City Watch, sir? I worked there for more than ten years, before the arrival of the new commander. And for five years now, I've been Lord Halton's sworn sword. Should I open this door? What is the password? Oak and iron guard me well. Right. Come in. Okay. You seem to know this place well. Yeah. Indeed. This place is often used for illegal fighting. The spectacle and the lure of gold attracts a lot of gamblers and good fighters. Lord Halton sometimes sends me here to recruit swordsmen for his personal guard. Can I take everything here or not? Thief, are they thief? Will they attack me? Tear off! Unless you damn, you really want to, you know, fight with me? Yeah, let's do this. Oh crap, are you seriously? Okay, die now. Wait, what am I doing now? Okay, I just want to get more experience for myself. Rest for myself to kill them all. He needs some poison for himself. Why? Oh damn. Uh, 
Yeah, die now. Yeah, I just can more experience for myself because I want to upgrade the level. So I really need their help for me to kill them all. Wait, coin. Yeah, I need more coin too. He's tell me go left. No. There you go. It's here. Wait. This lock's been forced open. Seven hells. Someone got here ahead of us, and they might still be inside. Either way, we still need to figure out what transpired here. Come on. No. Wait. Oh shit. Come on, Stainer. Get a move on. No use hanging around here. Can't you see there's no sign of Oris here? We'd better go look somewhere else before we bump into the city watch. Don't you think it's strange, Bulky? The boss has never gone messing on a job like this before. They're from the Reaper clan. Their den is in these sewers. And let's stay hiding. I need to learn more. Keep to the shadows, Desmond. I want to glean as much information as possible before we decide upon our next move. Well, there was nothing here except this locket that was just lying on the ground. He's probably gone to pick up the payment. For all we know, he may well be poking some ore as we speak. No, that's not like Oris. Something's happened to him, I'm sure of it. After them. I have some questions and I believe they will have the answers. What are you doing here? Eh? Where the hell did he come from? You're in Reaper territory. Get your ass out of here if you know what's good for you. I wouldn't hold my breath waiting if I were you. Holy crap. Dino. Spill everything you know right now. Have mercy, my lord. It was Stainer's idea to come here. I was just following him. I swear. They might be connected to the murders. Lucky. Do you have anything to do with the murders committed here? Speak. Me? I didn't kill anyone. We were just looking for our boss. I didn't do anything wrong. Yet you were here, nosing around. What did you find? Nothing, my lord. The gold cloaks took every last thing. Even the bodies. They didn't leave anything. Liar. Tell us what you found here. We just found a small locket lying on the ground. That's all. I swear on my mother's life. Give it to me. Now. Tell me, Alistair. Is that not your family's emblem engraved on this jewel? Yes, I know this locket very well. Garwin has worn it since he was a child, which definitely means he was here. Porky, correct? Tell me what happened here immediately. It's nothing to do with me, my lord, I swear. It's my master who knows. Where is your master? That's what I'd like to know. He's gone. He had something to do here, but I haven't heard from him since. Axe sent small groups in all directions to find him. He can tell you himself. He's in our den. Where is this den? We have our own emblem. We painted it on the walls leading to our den so that everyone knows it's our territory. Let's go then. Are you sure, my lord? We're taking a huge risk. That may be, but I have to know for certain if Garwin is dead or alive. What about him? What should we do with him? 
His death will serve no purpose. He must pay for his crime. Yeah, no. Nothing. I'm looking for my brother's murderer. This one doesn't interest me. Out of my sight, vermin. I'll let you live this time. But know that if you should ever cross my path again, you will rue that day. Oh, thank you, my lord. Now, let us head to their den. Okay, and now, yeah. Okay, so... Where should I go now? This way? Yeah. And it's safe. Yeah, let me kill you guys. Yeah, die now. Yeah. Ha. No, what should I do now? Get the map. I don't want to finish it quickly. Oh damn. So I really need to fight with them. Come here, come here. Just die now, please, and I just need more experience for myself. Yeah, let me fight with you guys. Okay, they all die now. Take everything.
Die. Now it's done here, and it's time to where? Where should I go? Damn, where am I now? Yeah, this way. And go right. Gonna go left and go up there. Maybe I can see something here. Open this door. Yeah. What the? Wait. Make sure everything is okay now. Damn! Where <laughs> am I now? I just missed my way. I lost my way. I know. I feel confused. And I don't know where should I go now. Yeah, I saw this place. Yeah. Okay, so is this is more interesting for myself. Oh no! If I want to use this, I will use this and put this here for myself. And okay, this is not awesome. Go up there. And where am I now? Yeah, I'll get back here. Hey, what are you doing here? Who are you? Who sent you here? Okay, open the door. And go down there. Open the cage. Holy crap. Okay, go up there. And. King's Landing. What the? No. I'm back here. Now I have to know where should I go now. I need to go here. Okay. Right. Yeah. And this way. And right. Go left. And this way. Yeah. Uh, this way. Here's the infamous hideout. Get your weapon ready.
Holy crap. Do that again. Do that again. Yeah. Kill them all. So this way, oh yeah. Come on. Do that, do that again. And yeah. Do that again. And that again. No, no, no. Okay, die. They all die now, and can I do it here? Yeah. Open the door. Oh crap! For you again. X. Well, well. If it isn't my old mugger friends, what a small world we live in. Porky came running up, saying that some kind of superhumans attacked him. He was talking about you, wasn't he? That fool was so scared of seeing you again that he bolted before I could even reason with him. But I'm not afraid of you. Then I should kill him. Last time, if it weren't for the gold cloaks. I would have split your skull open for sure. This time, though, there will be nobody to save you. You're going to regret messing with the Reapers. Now, first, I should kill him. Uh, me, you, to kill him first. Me, you should kill him first. And now, you are oh shit. And now, you should kill him. And me, now, you should. Crap, crap. Now do that, do that. Attack him and let save my ass. Yeah, I can save my ass. Yeah. Thank you, friend. Enough. You win. I have to admit you're a good fighter. What do you want? What do you know where his boss is? I want to know where he My brother was in a cellar that the Reapers attacked recently. I found his locket there. Your brother? That guy who had a bounty on his head? Yes, I need to find him. And seeing as you're part of this gang, you're going to tell me everything you know. Sure, but I doubt you'll learn much from me. Oris, our boss, he's the one who took care of it. I wasn't with him that night. I'm not the stealthy type. Where is this Oris? Well, that's the thing. We didn't hear from him until about an hour ago. Since he went to collect the payment, in fact. I just learned that he was arrested by the gold cloaks. Whose payment? No clue. Oris usually keeps that kind of information to himself. The gold cloaks took him to their blasted tower over there. I have a feeling we won't be seeing him again. The city watchtower, you say? There. I've answered your questions. If you're going to kill me, then kill me and be done with it. Oh. 
My quarrel is not with you, so I will let you go. But believe me, when I tell you that you do not want to cross paths with me ever again. I'll remember that. Thank you. Yeah. What with this empty cellar and Oris imprisoned in the city watchtower, I can see no end to the challenges Relor has set against me. Listen, I have good reason to believe that the famous city watchtower will be the answer to your problems. Your brother stands accused of patricide. If he still lives, he'll be in the dungeons. If he's been executed, they most likely will have stored his corpse in the basement while they confirm his identity. You are correct. There's no other option. I must get inside that tower. I should warn you, it won't be easy getting in. No civilians are allowed entry. The only way will be for you to pass for a gold cloak. It seems risky, but it could work. What would it take to pass for one of them? You will need a full uniform. Breastplate, helm, boots, gloves, and a cloak, of course. I believe we'll be able to find everything we need in town. If you yeah. find yourself unable to secure any of the items, some craftsmen could probably provide you with the equipment you require. But be warned, this service will not come cheap. Yeah, I know that. Let's give it a try. Yes, let's give it a try. But now, let me take everything here and yeah. Yeah, we want to talk with me or not. A better in a city watch. Okay, there is. There is no such creature on earth. Have so terrifying. Uh, uh, crap. The town's merchants should city be able watch to help us. Clock. There's also a chance we'll come across men from the city watch patrolling the streets. So, where should I go now? Where should I go now? Where should I go? Uh, yeah. Oh damn. This way. Where should I go now? This way? Okay, that way. Three. I need three more things for myself. I know that some city watchmen like to take a little nap when they're on their rounds. And it just so happens that this place is quiet and remote. Which makes it an ideal spot, I'd say. Yeah. I see. I can see that. Yeah. Follow you. I follow you. Yeah, you charge here. And now it's my time to charge again for myself. So now talk with Flamen. Welcome, my lord. Good day to you. I hear you're a leather craftsman. Aye, that I am. Are you interested in my wares? What do you need? He can sell me a need. Let's speak with him a little. I can see you have a good range of supplies in stock. Aye, there's something for everyone here, and in every size, too. Leather sells easily in King's Landing, like anywhere else. Anyway, I've no time for small talk. Either we strike a deal, or you move on. Thanks, but I'll come back later. I have some other business to see to. As you wish, my lord. Yeah. And talk with... Who? This guy. Nope. Hey, damn. Where is he? Yeah, open the door. And talk with him. Good day, my lord. What can I do for you? Good day to you. I'd like to inquire about having some armor forged. Very well, my lord. What sort of armor will you be needing? A city watch breastplate and helm. That's not usually my job, my lord. The gold cloaks have their own armor smith. Yes, I know. It's just that I lost mine, and the commander is bound to punish me if I go back without them. To be honest, I'd prefer it if this job stayed between the two of us. Certainly. I can arrange that for you. But a special order such as this will come at a much higher price. It's going to cost you a golden dragon. 
But for this price, your breastplate will be the envy of all. It will be gilded with a finish worthy of the greatest of men. It's too expensive there, I can't find this on there, eh? Very well, it's a deal. Here you are. Oh, damn! I'll get to work on your order right away. It'll be ready before you know it. Here's your equipment, my lord. Good day to you. The breastplate and the helm have been taken care of. Uh, seriously, I just pay one gold. Damn, I'm. S what have I done? What have I done? How can I help you? I'd like to buy a cloak. A gold cloak, to be precise. Unfortunately, the city watch have their cloaks made elsewhere. Precisely. I'll be able to show them the quality of your work. Prove to them that you're at the top of your game. Yes, you have a point. That might work. We, we can give it a go. But I will need to be compensated for the materials. It's a... Um, 25 stacks. That's my do. Then the deal is done. Oh, thank you. Oh, wait here. It won't, won't be long. Take care, my lord. See you soon, I hope. Yeah. Good. We have the cloak. I've even got... Then what have I done now? No? Hey! Coin? Yeah. And I lose a lot of gold for myself and then stupid thing I am. I am a stupid guy. No. I pay one you again? gold. What do you need? I need gloves and boots. But they have to be in the city watch's colors. That's my only condition. Hmm. I see. I do have something in stock that might be right for you, but I'll need to make a few adjustments. For 95 silver stags, I can make the lot for you. Yes. Isn't that rather a lot for such a simple alteration job? Oh, I can't stand hagglers. This is quality leather that I'm selling, not dirty old rabbit skins. And this is no ordinary task you're asking of me. We're talking about City Watch supplies. Come on, calm down. I could get into serious trouble for this, you understand. So you want to play the haggling game? Very well. My price just went up to 120 stags for your gloves and boots. Or well, feel free to look elsewhere. In your stream. If only I'd kept my mouth shut. Very well, here's the money and be quick about it. All right, stay here. It won't be long. Yeah. Here, it's done. Take good care of them. Dan, I pay one gold. There you go. Uh, I'm a stupid big guy. Okay, now it's time to use... Can I work? Oh, yeah. Okay, okay, no, I know that. Gold and gold clock and city watch, clothes, gold, boots, and uh, Right? So now where should I go now? That way. Wait a second. Left. And... Where? Left. 
this is where I stop. From this point forth, you're on your own. Be very careful once you're inside. Pry as much information from the guards inside as you can. Damn. While you're infiltrating this place, I'm going to inform Lord Halton of our progress. One I will be back gold. Then I'll return here to await your arrival. And I did it. Oh, crap. Okay. So I oppose here and I you know I just were like lamb. Like he. Okay? So I pause here and we will see what will happen and next time in Game of Thrones. Until then, this is James Lakers and, and thanks for watching for my video and take care.